Nigeria's Bola Tinubu has promised to defend the nation from terror and all forms of criminality in his first speech as president following his swearing-in on Monday. Tinubu also declared that fuel subsidies are gone, which will hike up the price of refined oil in a country in the throes of a serious economic crisis with double-digit inflation. I will not allow my personal interest to influence my official conduct or my official decisions that I will preserve, protect, and defend the constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. So, help me go. Thousands of Nigerians and several heads of government attended the swearing-in ceremony for the 71-year-old Tinubu in the country's capital, Abuja. But neither of the two main opposition candidates challenging Tinubu's election in court was present. We are here to further men and heal this nation, not tear and injure it. We shall defend the nation from terror and all form of criminality that threatens the peace, the peace and stability of our country. Tinubu's new government faces a mountain of urgent work starting with the economy, but there are other priorities. One of them will be to address insecurity which has spread like wildfire in recent years. Tinubu has touted his experience as Lagos governor to be one that would help him deliver. This is like